Hello guys, welcome to Hankins Custom Rifles and another episode of Hanks TV. Today's October 29th and we're on the bench with yet another muzzle loader to shoot today. This gun is built on a Remington 700 stainless steel short action. It's got a Brooks number 17 modified barrel on there with their hybrid flute. We've got another custom muzzle brake mounted on the end of the barrel to knock off some of the recoil from these uh, 45 caliber Muzzle loader shooting 275 grain bullets at a little over 3,000 feet per second. The gun has a Night Force Picatinny rail mounted with two extra mounting screws, so we've got six screws drilled and tapped into the receiver. It's got uh, Night Force rings, 30 millimeter, six hole design on the rings. The scope is a Trigicon, I think that's how you say that, Trigicon. 5 to 20 by 50 power and it's got a, a bunch of fiber optics wrapped around here and somehow or another they go inside and it's in the reticle it looks pretty neat if it's really uh, bright outside you can't see the fiber optic glowing but in the day in the uh, dusk or darkness the fiber optic glows and it's almost like a lighted reticle or if you're looking through a uh, an archery sight pin that has the fiber optic turned around where you're just seeing the very edge of the optic it uh, it looks pretty neat so far so I'm gonna shoot it a little bit today sight it in get it ready to go to the customer this goes to Louis Savato up in I believe upstate New York so as soon as I get this sighted in I'll get it boxed up and shipped off to him now he didn't want a ramrod on his gun, so he bought one of these three-piece ramrods from me that folds up pretty easy like that, and you can put it in your pocket when you need it. You just turn it loose, and it pops back into the ramrod. And I did put a witness mark on this for him, shooting the 78 grains of powder, and we're going to sight this in with a 275-grain Pittman Acumax. And... Um, when I get this all sighted in, I'll get back with you guys here shortly. Well, guys, we got this one sighted in. It was a very easy job to sight this gun in. I shot it three times. We bore sighted it at 100 yards, and I was within about a half an inch of the, the bullseye, so I just shot two more to see what we got. We got a three-shot group under about a half an inch, and um, it was really quick and easy to sight this one in, get it ready to go to uh, Louis Savato up in New York so this thing will ship out tomorrow afternoon sometime and I'm sure Louie will like it I like that scope that's the first one of these scopes that I've ever shot or used or looked through or anything it adjusted easy I got everything cleared up the sight picture was good and I can really see that little green dot in the scope right now and it I think it might have made a difference for a quick acquisition of the target so it's pretty nice I may buy one of those for myself one of these days and mount it on a gun of my own. But anyway, we're done with this one, guys. Give me a thumbs up on the YouTube video. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Visit Hank's Message Board. Until next time, we'll see you later.